I want something to be done. More cameras, more lights. People living at Via Trans Casey Apartments have had enough. They say the lack of security at the high rise for seniors and people with disabilities makes them and their property targets for crime. My tail light's been broken, my tires have been slashed. Last night they say as many as seven vehicles were vandalized. I came out, my front windshield was smashed and the two tires on the left side were, were sliced. Denise Dunaway's front windshield was smashed. I didn't know how I was going to move. I couldn't move that car. It looked like somebody hit it with a baseball bat. Witnesses say whoever went on the wild rampage was seen running into the building. Problem is, they say the cameras surrounding the building don't work. We also saw what appeared to be bulbs missing from light poles surrounding the property, and the metal security gates aren't working either. Only one security at night. They have a security guard that'll come between 2 p.m. and 4 p.m. There's nothing going on about at that time. Between 10 p.m. and 6 a.m., there's all kinds of drama here. Via Trans Casey is managed by the San Antonio Housing Authority, which maintains strict guidelines and quality standards. In a statement, Saha says it's investigating damage to seven vehicles of residents parked at the complex. You know, they used to have a little security guards. They used to come around and, you know, close the gates and save the gates. But they're not doing nothing. It's like they don't care.